Anybody else in this field, you are a little bit worried about the American in lane five. Tomorrow, Honda just went through your picture from Japan. Leon Marchand from France in one. Simon Lee of Australia in seven. From Hungary, Dominic Torok. Will be representing the home country. Now, we've only just recently seen him, and he's got another swim. Apostolos Papastamos for Greece in six. Two Americans have made the final. He's not a loser, he's a loser in three. Here's the man I've just been referring to. Going to Texas very soon to swim, Carson Foster in lane five. And it's going to be a Russian-USA battle here, I think. Hard to see beyond America three, Russia four, America five. Papastamos, if we go by what we saw in the heats, We'll be a little way back on the butterfly, but we'll catch up on the three remaining strokes. But it may not be quick enough over the first hundred, maybe to push the two Americans and the Russian. We'll see. 4.18.6 for Borodin in the heats. 4.19.14. Championship record Hugo Gonzalez from two years ago. 4.14. I would not put anything past Carsten Foster the way he swam last night. He's going to make up a lot of seconds to get there, but do you know what? Such was the speed he had, albeit only in the freestyle last night, that who knows? We will discover in the next four and a half minutes. Four hundred meters individual medley: France, Hungary, USA, Russia. Two from America: Greece, Australia, and Japan have representation in this one. All the action, I think, is likely to come from the three centre lanes, and then maybe belatedly, or certainly from the leg two, maybe Apostolos Papastamos might come into it. His butterfly is not as good as the three strokes. The Honda off to. Uh, a really good start on the butterfly leg. He leads after 50. Second is Foster. Third, that joint second with Marshall he was. Fourth is Seabom Lee. It's the Frenchman on the far side who's having a very good butterfly leg here, as is the Japanese. And Carson Foster is going to be second behind the Japanese at the turn. Marshall. That's second adrift, but that's the butterfly. Now, this is where Papastamos in six. Watch him. Had a very good backstroke and an excellent breaststroke, so he might come into the mix soon. At the moment, we are bookends. Honda in eight. Marshall at the top, and right in the middle is Carson Foster, and they're right on world junior record line. I did say that uh, well, it's held by Carson Foster, of course. At 4.13.39, set just a matter of weeks ago. Now, what was the uh, second split? 2.01.03, so keep an eye on that. He's now taking the lead, Carson Foster. Waiting for the uh, Greek to come through. He's starting to make his move now in six. Coming up into second place, Papastamos. Behind Foster, who, when he set the world junior record, 2.01.03, inside it. Inside his own record now, Carson Foster. With uh, Papastamos second. Seabombly is going quite well. So too Ilya Borodin. At the moment, Jason Lusa of the USA is a long, long way back. Papastamos is 
taking on Carson Foster. The Greek moves to the front on the breaststroke. He's got the better breaststroke of the three, as he's proving here. But when it comes, he's got to get a big lead for the front crawl. Otherwise, he's going to come straight past him. Borrowed in now in second. Foster third. This is developing into a very, very interesting race indeed. Next world junior record time for the split was set by Foster a few weeks ago at 3.13.97. Look at the Greek go. Look at Papastamos. He's right there and he's right in advance. And well, I did say he'd have to get a big lead over Foster. He's got a big lead over Foster and quite a lead over Borodim. That world junior record, 3.13.97. Oh, he's massively inside it. Now Borodin up against Papastamos. I don't want to write Foster off, but I think I can at this stage because the Greek, whose card I marked for you at the beginning, his butterfly is not that brilliant, but after that, backstroke, breaststroke, and front crawl are superb. Foster's trying to come back and is coming back, but he's given himself way too much to do. Papastamos now up against Borodin. Foster surely is not going to make up that ground. It's a question of whether Borodin can catch Papastamos. I don't think he can. And I think the Greek might be on his way to a world junior record here. Not great over the first hundred, terrific over the next three. And it's going to be Papastamos right ahead of the world junior record. It's going to go and he's going to get gold for 11.93. Great stuff from the Greek. Borrowed in second, Marshawn getting third. So Foster not even getting a medal in the end. The world junior record holder up until today doesn't even get in the top three. Pampa Stamos from the backstroke leg onwards.